Welcome to Peru, we're Eric and Sarah, and today we're taking you to Machu Picchu. <laughs> we began our journey in Ollantaytambo. We actually stayed the night there last night. That's where the train begins from. And it was actually a surprisingly cute little town. There's some ruins there. And we just enjoyed walking around and enjoying our evening there. And then we took Inca Rail all the way here to Aguas Calientes today, or also known as uh, Machu Picchu Pueblo. <laughs> That's right, so you have to take a train from Huella Tantambo to Machu Picchu Pueblo and actually this town is kind of cute. <laughs> so we're a little bit surprised and so we're gonna just kind of explore it and enjoy our time here. I feel like probably shouldn't go down this way, but we're doing it. It's just a nice river. I feel like you should be able to just like go down and hang out by it. But there is no one hanging out by it. But we don't like people, so we left town. And here we are. Pretty much sums up our short tour of Machu Picchu Pueblo. We gotta get up super early tomorrow morning, so we're gonna rest up for the evening. So we'll see you then. Okay, so it is what time in the morning? Five o'clock in the morning. Five o'clock in the morning, and we're headed to the bus. Our goal is to be on the very first bus that leaves at 5 30 and be the very first one to Machu Picchu <laughs> so that there's not too many people there. So we'll see what happens. Let's hope. <laughs> Only a few people in front of us. Hey shield time! No, this is tienen que sacar en físico mi vuelto solo es la compra. Pero es el bus. The change, the change for the ticket to first. This is the reservation. Uh, no, it's the ticket. No, no ticket. Ready. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So that's a front air. Run. Okay, that was insanely stressful because he kept saying that our ticket was not actually the ticket because we were just showing him the email receipt which had a scanner bar thing on it and he was like, you have to go two blocks up the street to get your ticket. And we're like, what are you talking about? But it was attached to the email as a PDF, so we got it and we're on the very first bus, so we're all good. <laughs> and we're going with our friends Drew and Alex too. They got their stuff sorted out. How you guys doing? Good. Stuff. This is Drew and Alex. You should follow their channel. They're also... Awesome! <laughs> and they love mornings. Love <laughs> uh, a good morning. Love I'm ready for a nap. How bad is that? We're here. Okay. <laughs> After a half an hour bus ride <laughs> and a like, few complications with our tickets and tripod, we have made it to Machu Picchu. And it's all gonna be worth it. That's now right. we're just gonna enjoy it. The bus, the first bus leaves at 5.30. It leaves every 10 minutes, so you can come whenever you want, but we want to be here right at six when it opens, so oh my hopefully there's not too many people. Look at this view already. This is what? crazy. We're literally the first ones in here. This is amazing. Wow. Look at this full view right now. Wow. I can't 
can't actually believe that this we're here. Is this is insane. We got here and there was absolutely no one at the we top. Have perfect conditions yeah. behind us. Look it's behind us so right now. nice. This is, this is incredible. The sun is just rising. There was no one here, so we could take all our own photos for like 10, 15 minutes, and it is just beautiful. I am <laughs> way too in love so with this. Cool. What do you think of this? Oh, it's so amazing. There's no one here. Look, there's no one. There's just llamas. That's <laughs> it. Us and some llamas. Oh, I love it. So I would definitely say coming here really early, as early as you can, is the best way to come to Machu Picchu. We got here at like 6 o'clock. We took the 5.30 bus. Um, I know you can also hike here. There's the Inca Trail and the Salcante Trek. Um, and those ones, I think, the Inca Trail at least, you actually arrive here at Machu Picchu. So if you're into hiking or trekking, definitely check out the Inca Trail. We did not do it because just for physical reasons, I don't think I'd be able to do it with my knee or anything. But man, it is just incredible here. This is... <sighs> Sometimes you just need to take a breath and actually just enjoy it. It's incredible. This is crazy. Incredible. We're at like the most famous photo spot and it is just so beautiful. The sun's just coming up and wow, I, what is this? We got our ponchos on. Oh, yeah. Of course you got to get the obligatory poncho picture. How Peruvian are we right now? <laughs> not very, not, not very, very, still not how very tourist, Peruvian. How touristy yeah, are we touristy, right now? That's more like there you go. <laughs> oh, it's just so amazing. I can't, it doesn't feel real to you. No, it here. feels it's crazy. Amazing. 6.45 in the morning. <laughs> Wow. Man, this is perfect. I love it. Okay, so the most annoying part about up here is that you can't go backwards once you go down. So we've been just trying to take our nice photos or our videos, our and time. this guy keeps telling us that we have to move on, and he's uh, he's threatening Drew and Alex that he's gonna call the police. And he, it's actually ridiculous. It's just like there's no like one there's... here. It doesn't matter. Like why can't we just enjoy it and yeah. take it in? It's annoying that they like rush you through. We literally paid so much money to yeah, be you here. Yeah, so much money you to be here. You paid so much money to be here. Like sixty-two dollars. And you come dollars. all the way out here. And there's like no one up here. Yeah. Like who cares if we're taking so, a few more photos? I don't know who needs to see this, but it's kind of a load of garbage yeah, to, kind of to really push us along when really we don't need to because yeah. there's not that many people here. Yeah. We're actually fine right now. <laughs> I understand if that there was, was like hordes of yeah, people in the afternoon. Packed, of course we'd move but on. Like, but like literally there's, on. there's no one here. No one here. <laughs> well now we gotta move on so it's good. It's nice. It's really beautiful still here this morning. So Sun beautiful. Is through. Oh man I could just stay here forever. I kind of want to. I would if we could. What if we could but clearly we're not allowed to. getting a chance to walk like through the ruins and it's beautiful all the stonework and everything it's it's crazy because I believe Machu Picchu was um, created in like the 1400s which like yeah that's still like 600 years ago but it, it's actually not that long ago and I always forget that like that's actually like when people came, start, first started coming to America and South America and uh, yeah, and this is just incredible. What 
you got there? I don't know. There's all these little houses, but you can't go inside. But they look cool. Look how cute this is. I see, I totally live in there. Oh, yeah. All you need is a little roof. Nah, I'd camp. <laughs> wow. feel weird just like being here <laughs> yeah it's kind of weird it's like a mystical place and then you're just here what I wonder is whether Machu Picchu would actually be as famous if there wasn't this mountain behind like it's just such a signature mountain with this community but like if you didn't have that mountain would it just be like some weird rocks and it's just picturesque you know I know it's just like it's just like perfect but would it be as famous if it didn't have like or would this even, perfectly framed mountain behind or oh. even as well preserved you yeah know? <laughs> no. would anyone care if you didn't you can take a photo with this mountain behind I don't know this is crazy Look at this valley right now. This is insane. They really just built this on the edge of a cliff. I don't know how they got all these supplies up here. It's insane. Wow. I think they probably just kicked it off the mountain, you know? They, they, they probably just, just hack, away. hack away at the rocks. Yeah, but like, anytime you have to go get food, you have to walk forever to find That's some That's true. Meat. Good point. <laughs> Unless they just had llamas. There's llamas. Look at them. How Peruvian is this? Yeah, you gonna hug him again? Yeah. I did give one a big hug one time. It was really nice. How you doing? Uh oh, he stopped chewing. It's nice to meet Watch you. Watch out. Please don't spit on me. <laughs> I'd rather not be spat on today. I don't know. I think he's gonna get you. It's kind of like I eat. It's definitely like you. to call my mom. <laughs> we're gonna FaceTime or we just FaceTime Eric's mom and it's really funny because we're just at Machu Picchu. <laughs> Hello! We're at Machu Picchu! That's crazy! <laughs> <laughs> hey! hey. <laughs> we, you made it! Yeah, we realized we had full bars so we thought it was funny to call you. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. Yeah. There. Okay, well we'll call soon again. Say bye to Machu Picchu. Bye. Bye. <laughs> yeah. bye. That was funny. I don't know why that's so funny to me. We just had full bars, so we called both of our parents and it's just funny to be like at Machu Picchu and showing your parents. I don't know. I just think that's hilarious for some reason. Alrighty, well. That's Machu Picchu. That's Machu Picchu. So this has been our little, I don't know, adventure here. <laughs> and it's really totally worth it, yeah. in my opinion. It like, actually is worth the yeah. money. It's yeah. it's a lot of money. Yeah. We're gonna put all the prices on the <laughs> yeah. at the very end, so make yeah. sure you watch the end. It is worth the money. Definitely wish we were rushed rushed along. Yeah. Totally. Technically you they say you have four hours, but like we've only been here for three and we were yeah. pretty rushed along. Yeah. It is super cool. It's really I definitely cool definitely to come, come here. Like um, I don't know. I would I would say you could you could go with a guide, but you will be moved around like a lot faster. Yeah. Uh, we went with that one, and we really enjoyed our time. Yeah. Honestly, it was wonderful. Yeah. So now we just take a bus 
back to Aguas Calientes, yeah. and then we're gonna take a train all the way back to Cusco. Cusco. No, yeah. train to Ollantaytambo, bus back yeah. to Cusco now. So yeah. yeah, we still have a bit of a journey ahead of us, but we're gonna leave you here. Uh, all of the costs for Machu Picchu, how to get to Aguas Calientes or Machu Picchu Pueblo, and the train and everything, we're gonna put at the end of this video. So um, watch yeah, the end. watch the end, and we'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Thanks for watching.